All right, here we go. I'm going to assign textures to these things. Uh, first thing you want to do is obviously just select all of your objects that are going to have the textures you're using and get an AI standard surface. If it's not under here, under favorite materials, you can find it under new, then Arnold shaders, and it's right there. I'm going to call this um, still life. All right, well, now I'm going to call it still TX for texture. Uh, first thing, you want color. So you get a file, and then my textures are not in there. They're going to be over here in my source images folder. So since I am using Gideon tiles, I can use the UV tiling thing here. If you're not, then don't worry about it. Don't need to do it. Now that's showing up in the scene. Make sure all those luminance is off for the base color ones. Under where things could be black, because we're doing a metal nest map. Where is it? There we go. Uh, if you can, normally you'd want this to say uh, color space raw, which should be under utility, but since it's not letting me do that, it's just going to make it say RGB back. Cool, oh, back. And then the specular roughness, not diffuse roughness. Do the same thing. Grab my little roughness map, where are we? Oh, item, off of luminance. Make sure I got item, yep, got it for that one. And then for normal maps, they're going to be under geometry, then bum mapping file. Change use as to change the space normals. And then under bump value, we're going to get that weird purple normal map. This one would also want to see raw, just like metalness and roughness. But uh, since we don't have the option, it's fine. Oh, wait. I forgot to set it to Udom. All right, there we go. And. That's all you really need. Color, metalness, specular roughness, and normal. And it should render with all your textures. I'm just doing the Arnold preview render, which you get from uh, over here. It just renders your workspace. Anyway, that's all.